I promise y'all I am not a hoarder. Good morning, Glarian fam. It is graduation day. I'm actually staying home because I don't know when people are showing up. So I'm staying home from church and I'm wearing my Alaska chick sweater and this thing because it's a little chilly outside and I'm wearing my extra tufts. I don't know if you can see those or not, but they're so comfortable y'all. This is the first time I've actually like worn them, worn them because I am trying to make them last as long as possible and I'm going to use them a lot this summer with the horses. So I'm really trying not to use them as much as I can, but I think the trend for us girls today is to wear all of our extra tufts for um, graduation. So yeah, and I know some of the girls are wearing dresses and then they're going to wear their hoodies, their outpost hoodies, and I don't really like my outpost hoodie, like how it fits, so I'm wearing the Alaska Chicks because I feel like it. My hair is still drying, so I pardon, excuse the mess or whatever you need to say, I need to say. Yeah, I'm a mess. So I'm actually heading down to the cabin that my family's staying in. I'm gonna go turn up the heat and see if I need to clean it, if it's been cleaned or not, and then see if I need to grab any bedding or anything for them. So I'm gonna go do that and then probably head back up to the house and wait for people to show up. So super fun. So I walked in um, to Cedar A, which is the cabin that my family's staying in and <laughs> It wasn't clean. So I get to clean Cedar A, which isn't bad. I mean, I'm just doing kind of touch up stuff, but it's kind of annoying. But hey, I get to clean more, right? Find joy in the little things, right? So yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. Apparently they're showing up in like two hours, so I'll definitely get done before then, but it's just, okay, lack of communication or something going on here, but whatever. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> You're on the ropes course. Yeah. It's so pretty when the ice is all melted, but it's really pretty when the ice is there. In a few days, the ice will be the rainbow. Maybe. Big, big, big. We can ask Jake. Jake literally Very knows a nice lot. Size. So we are going down to graduation and we're taking the sneaky oh, route. So it's gonna be super funny. Gonna see how this goes. They've been decorating for a couple hours, so no idea what they're decorating. But we'll see. Yes, guys. We are that good. Jack. Jump around. Jump around. There you go. Yep, totally. Get your wiggles out. Roll Don't over. Roll yep, roll Don't over. Roll Jump in the lake. <laughs> Jump in that. Okay, okay. Can you go over? Yeah. Okay. Hey, y'all, back from graduation. I'm sorry I didn't vlog a lot of it. It was just super fun. We did a staff impressions video, and then they did a video of us when we were interviewing about just outposts, whatever. So it was super fun. I'm actually back home. It's almost 9, and I'm going to organize my junk. So y'all are about to see all of this stuff. Hopefully compact. Actually, that's an empty box, so I don't know what I'm going to do with that. Hopefully all this will compact a little bit better because I'm moving soon. So this is what I ended up with. This stuff, these boxes, that bag, and just add my horse stuff, which is already in Fairbanks, and a black suitcase and my blankets and a guitar. And that's literally all I own. I could live in an apartment and I'd be totally fine. I have like all my kitchen stuff that I need. It's crazy. But, uh, yeah, a lot of stuff. But I only have furniture left in Tennessee and, like, kid stuff. So I'm kind of proud of myself, too. But at the same time, I hate having all this junk, too. But it's a lot. But, yeah. Lots of stuff. Lots of memories. And, yeah, lots of stuff. Hey, y'all. So after going through my stuff, I'm like, this literally is so much stuff. I promise, y'all, I am not a hoarder. I do like being prepared and I do like having my own stuff as well though. So I don't know exactly. So those two big boxes, there's a bin and then a big box. That's just all winter stuff. And of course winter stuff is super fluffy. I was trying to get those bags that you can take the air out, the vacuum sealer bags, but couldn't find them. I didn't buy them and nobody had any extra around. So I ended up not doing that, but that would have saved me a ton of space. With that, and honestly, I'm going to go through this next winter and I'm going to be like, what did I not use? What did I use? So that's what I did with this winter too. So I did get rid of a bunch of stuff. So 
super excited with that. Um, still praying for a ride to go up to Fairbanks. Uh, I think I have a couple ideas of how I'm getting up there. Just praying that the director in Fairbanks lets me come up early so I can train. Otherwise, I'm going to ask if I can train horses here <laughs> because I do need to get ready and get ready for CHA testing. So, whoopee! Super excited. But, uh, yeah, I am not exactly calm right now. But at the same time, I know God's planning is perfect as well. But I'm just ready to get to Fairbanks and get kind of settled. I know this summer is going to be super crazy because we're going to be living in cabins and whatnot. My stuff's going to be spread all over the place. So I just got to hang in there. It's okay. A couple more months and then the girls have, and I have a house. And then I can spread out a little bit more. And that's going to be amazing. So I'm not trying to rush through things. I'm trying to live in the moment because it's... A season it's just a little time so I'm gonna live in the moment enjoy a few days left in victory even it might be a few weeks I don't know what's gonna happen but we'll see God's got a better idea so I promise y'all I'm not a hoarder <laughs> so I'm gonna end the vlog here it was a great day a great official graduation it was super fun super cute chill just staff and family so it was pure chill that's pretty awesome so i'm actually spending the day with my grandparents and my little brothers tomorrow probably doing a few hikes i don't think i'm gonna do much vlogging with that um but we'll see what happens i'm gonna get some pretty good shots so if you don't follow me on instagram go check it out because i will be posting some gorgeous pictures of the hikes whether or not i do this vlog or not so find joy in the little things and give god glory in all things bye